Financial services and systems might be re-engineered to be more sustainable. To tell us what exactly that means is Laurent Brosi from BCGE. Welcome. Hello. So tell me, what is sustainable finance? So basically, sustainable finance is an approach of investments that goes beyond pure financial considerations. It also takes into account extra financial criteria, mainly environmental, social and governance ones. Why? in order to better identify the risk and opportunities associated with companies over the long term. Although criteria such as um, employees' loyalty, customer satisfaction, reputation or environmental awareness do not appear as such in the balance sheet, they definitely have an impact on the, on the value of a company, especially in the long term. So it's our belief that companies which anticipate and manage current and future economic, environmental and social risk and opportunities will emerge as the leaders of tomorrow. So can you explain how it affects the market today? So sustainable finance go back to the 20s with the creation of the very first collective portfolio of ethical investment, which excluded companies involved in the production of tobacco, alcohol or armaments. Since then, the market has continu continuously developed and today investors can choose between various uh, investment strategies, including uh, integrations, engagements or impact finance. But to come back to your questions today, more and more investors are questioning the purpose of their investments. These investors hold the asset managers accountable for the impact of investment decisions on society at large. Some investors have already integrated those new concerns and take into account sustainable and responsible uh, criteria into funds management. The success of the principle for responsible initiatives confirms the growing interest of institutional investors worldwide. It has now over 1,200 uh, signatories representing more than 45,000 billion US dollars under management. So, to summarize, today one thing is sure, sustainable finance is assuming an increasing importance within the financial industry. According to the Eurozif organizations, the volume of assets managed in accordance with socially responsible principle represents now around 10 to 15 percent of the European asset management market. So that's worldwide, but what about the market situation in Switzerland? Mm -hmm. So basically it clearly follows the same European tendencies and as can be seen in the graph, from 2005 to 2013, the sustainable investment market in Switzerland have undergone a significant growth with a total of assets under management amounting to 57 billion Swiss francs in 2013. That being said, we have to admit that it is still a niche market. It accounts for less than 4% of the market as a whole in Switzerland. So explain to me what BCGE are doing with integration and sustainable finance. So basically we started in this field almost 20 years ago. So we have a pragmatic and non-dogmatic approach. We believe that companies which best integrate economical, environmental and social challenges are likely to offer the best long-term returns. Sustainability analysis improves our understanding of the securities we are, we are invested in. So it leads to better informed investment decisions. For instance, overlooking risk, such as condoning corruptions or lack of environmental responsibility, will negatively affect companies' outlook. By contrast, companies' ability to benefit from the so-called sustainability-related trends, such as the development of new energies, opens essential opportunities. In that field, our offer mainly focuses on Swiss stocks and on multi-asset investment vehicles, broadly supported by an open architecture. Presently, the volume of asset managed in accordance with financial and extra-financial criteria represents close to 20% of all institutional funds and mandates. For these assets, we aim to meet the financial, social and environmental expectation of our clients. Our objective is to generate returns at least similar to traditional investments, while taking into account sustainability. 
Great. Well, thanks so much for coming in to explain sustainable finance to us today. You're welcome. Thank you. Well, that's all we have time for here. If you want to know more about sustainable finance, you can check back in with Dukascopy TV. Goodbye.